Okay, we have a fun haul coming up. Yeah, let's go with that. Uh, two other things are for a taste test. They're ice cream. They're melting. They're in the freezer. So you'll get, we'll see that eventually. Yeah, we'll go with that too. Okay, uh, first up is Joanne Fabrics. I ordered something from them. And this is the second order, not the first order. That one. Yeah, I got them. Okay. Uh, this is the uh, second order, so uh, I get to go back to them and get the other order. But uh, it is the uh, insert for masks, and this is thinner than I expected. I'll have to get some different ones eventually. But that'll work for now. Right? Right. Alright, I unfeed that one. So that way I can give it to you. Okay. Cool. I have a bunch of them. Okay, um, next up is that I got another thing for a taste test. That Simply Caramel Milky Way. She's trying to kill me. That could be worse. Um, but she's trying to kill me right back because we also got Chips Ahoy Reese's. Yeah. I don't know if we tried this before. I think we have, but she doesn't think we have. So I'm probably going to eat this fucker again. On a good note, we got that at the dollar store. Yeah, actually, yeah, that's from the dollar store. Who would have thought, right? And at the dollar store, I was very amused by this. At, I got pens. This is a uh, glass paint brush pen. Or it says marker. And uh, I got black in this version. White in this version. Oh, I did get purple in this version. Oh, I didn't know that. I forgot I got purple. Oh, I did. Uh, it's red and green. Let me out. I'm stuck in your pocket. I'm not in your pocket. Okay. Um, and then there's these ones called Chalk Rider, and it says it does all the same stuff. So, uh, it's, I don't know why they say it's a erasable. Wet erasable mess, dust free. That doesn't sound like something that would be very good for writing on your ceramics permanently. So these might be at better for at this, and these might be good for just temps. Because apparently these are washable, and it would really suck to draw a design and it just washes right off. Good point. Because washable also means smudgeable. Mm -hmm. And that would be purple and pink all over my hand. But they these ones say chalk writer. Yeah, I know. That's kind of weird. So you see the difference? So these are for great for chalkboards, dry erase boards, windows, mirrors, ceramic, and metal. Yeah. See? Maybe we could grab some glass and see if we can uh, draw, a, I don't know, a middle finger. Okay, so I got some newspapers. Always good for her. Coupons. Okay, uh, I got myself a drinky poo. I got some more hairspray. I hope that is hairspray, not mousse, because their mousse is in the same container. It says hairspray. Okay, I'm just asking. It's going to be really funny if I, got, I end up moosing the... Uh, wasps instead of uh, tear spraying them. Uh-huh. So, uh, t what did you do to your uh, wasp? Oh, I gave it luxuries. <laughs> yes. Um, uh, yeah, so, it's brushable control, too. Uh, I'm done. It's all over from here. Well, the thing is, I keep getting wasps. I'm allergic to wasps. Like, five a day. I'm allergic to wasps. And I'm here, like, every day. No, you're not, but still. It feels like every day. But, so, uh, yeah. We need something to kill wasp with, and my hair she doesn't. 
and she doesn't want me to end up in the hospital. My hairspray is dying because that the uh, ex the one guy came over and he's like, oh, hairspray takes care of these guys faster than my bug spray. Hairspray this. And last up is my testing materials. You can tell me wrap one. Yours got wrapped better than the one that I lost. The, oh, one, that I, the one that I got, he just put in the bag. So the wrapping that we did at the one store, they actually did. Uh -huh. Oh my god. So we got some. Mugs. I'm keeping this so I can wrap it up. Oh yeah, go ahead. You can use as much as you want. Okay, cool. So we got some mugs to experiment with. To test those that crawly things on. <laughs> I'll probably get some glass to experiment. Or I could just draw on that thing. Mm -hmm. We could write Happy Halloween. Yep. Alright. So I went to a dollar store without her. And I'm going to start cooking. And then I went to dollar store with her. Yep. So I have all these receipts for her. Like, I have a ton of receipts for her. So I'm just going to throw all the receipts in one bag, and she can take care of this later. All right, so I went to Walmart without her, and those that know me know I work in the healthcare field. So when I went to Walmart, I found fabric. Again. Always. So I found this one that has, like, the heartbeats on it. And it's blue, and it says first responders, fat quarters on it. And it's really pretty. It's a blue with hearts, and it's got the rhythm for your heartbeat. I picked that up. I got one that's got a stethoscope in the shape of a heart with hearts on it. And then I got one that has a nurse's hat, a broken heart, a band-aid, rubber gloves, and a hat. And they're all blue, or some form of blue. Then I went to a dollar store without her, and I got a new facial sponge Yay! to help get, like, the face mask and stuff off. I got hand soap that tastes, not taste, that smells like fresh pine in the shape of a Christmas tree for the holidays. Are you eating your hand soap? Sure, why not? Then I picked up these two Bior Love Your Pores Rose Cortez Charcoal Face Mask. It helps clean your face. That's what I got without her. Okay. Then the dollar stores I did go to with her. So, I was shocked when I found this. I was ecstatic and shocked at the same time. He put it in two bags, Melissa. Well, Alright, so for whatever reason, the dollar store is now carrying name brand cups. This is from the brand Zak, Z-A-K. It's made in China, and it's a Star Wars cup, and it's R2-D2. What isn't something made in China? I want to know what it says www.zach.com, so I'm curious to know how much it actually is. Probably 14 bucks. Well, we can find out when we're done this lovely haul. And I got that for someone for the holidays. So, that can go in here. Then I picked up some Christmas ribbon because I have a crazy idea for certain people for the holidays this year. I'm not spending a lot on people this year. Um, can't afford it. My, no, it's not even that I'm broke. It's just that, like, my mortgage and my stability and my financial obligations are more important than gift giving. I'm broke. 
But my thought about it is it's not about how much you spend on people. It's that you thought of them. Yep. So I have a crazy idea, and Melissa over there thinks it's an awesome idea. I support every idea you usually have. So I picked up two sets of ribbons for my crazy idea. This has the red trucks on it, and it is nine feet. And this one says, the elves made me do it with elf shoes. And this is also nine feet. Then I also picked up some face masks by the brand Freeman. It comes with two face masks. And then I found Jojo Sawa. How the hell do you say her name? Yeah, how do you talk cereal? There's a surprise charm inside here. It's a cupcake scented jumbo bath bomb. And it's a pink bow. Okay. Alright. So then I also picked up... Everyone knows I'm obsessed with my cats. Yeah. So I found these cute little signs that I can put outside my house this year. Or when it gets into the springtime. And it says, all my kids have paws. And then I had I picked up one that says, this house is not a home without a cat. Ah. So I'm going to stick these outside. If they get ruined or warped because of the weather, I only spent a dollar on them. So it's not a big deal. I know that's lost that's all I have with decorating. But you understand, right, Melissa? Again, that's why I spent on decorating. <laughs> All right, so then I also picked up some new hair ties. This is gold and purple, and this is silver and black. Like my soul. I also picked up this cool bath bomb making kit. It says make your own bath bomb, the Avengers. It's Avengin Apple Scent. It makes two bath bombs to share. Contains everything you need. Except for IQ. <laughs> I. Damn. Thank you. I also. I also picked up. Alright, so I don't have a dog, but again, I'm preparing myself for the holidays. So even if I can't, like, see people, I can still, like, get a box and, like, nail those stuff. So I picked up these Purina Dental Life Daily Oral Care Dog Cheats. Their chewy, porous texture helps clean hard to reach teeth. You always give them to somebody you think of a dog. I also found this cool new toothpaste that I want to try. It's Crest 3D White Fluoride at Anti Cavity Toothpaste Whitening Therapy. Deep Clean char uh, Charcoal Integrating Mint. Invigorating? Invigorating mint? I don't know. That would make more sense. Invigorating is all work. All right. I also picked up more of this hairspray because Brian's obsessed with it. And a dollar is not going to break me for hairspray. So I picked up four of them because he found my stash of hairspray that I bought that I was trying to save for holidays. Hmm. And, you know, at least I could do was buy more of it to, like, stash away. If he's going to use it and he doesn't realize I buy it from the dollar store, I'm a happy girl. I'll make these next week. Okay. I'll make them in the next uh, 10 minutes. No, you're fine. I also picked up the Pantene Gold Series Leave on Detangling Milk. Infused with Aragon Oil, preps and strengthens hair for styling by detangling and softening your curls for dry, damaged hair. My hair, when I come out of the shower, is very wavy. And when I go to sleep, it dries on its own. But then when I wake up, it's so curly, it's tangled. So I'm going to give this a go, and maybe it'll work well for me. Ouch. Uh. I'm just trying to get shit out of the way. Oh, you got a lot of shit. Yeah, I did. These are the fabrics I was telling you about. I see. I did pretty. Yep. Alright, so then... I've seen...
seen this. I've seen this little Nerf knockoff gun at Walmart for like ten bucks, but they had it at the dollar store, so I bought it. It's a Battle Royale Mini Strike Mini Launcher, capable with other major brands. So I picked this up. It fires up to thirty feet. Picked this up, and they also had the extra darts to go with it. Again, I'm trying to watch what I spend for the holidays for people. So I thought this and the bath bombs of the Avengers would be cute for somebody special and close to my heart. Then another person that's close to my heart is obsessed with penguins. So I picked this up. It's a little metal container. I'm going to get a gift card for this person and then put the gift card in here. And then put the rest of her family's gift cards all in here with um, little love notes, uh, excuse me, with all their names on it so they know that it comes from my heart and that I love them all and they mean a lot to me. Alright, I know Halloween is just around the corner and I probably already have this at home, but I had to get another one just in case they don't have them next year. And it's got handprints on it and it says help me. Oh, help me, help me, I'm going to die. I still can't decorate my window because it's too hot and they'll melt. Alright, so then I also picked up this Crayola Fun Felt Feature. It's a felt board with 12 felt pieces. Um, one of my nieces, um, she's learning a lot and she loves animals. Um, I don't see her that often. But I thought of her as soon as I saw this because I see her photos that her parents post on Facebook and Instagram. So it's very whimsical and I'm sure she'll love it. I also found this cute bag that says gift sack. It says no peeking until Christmas. So I was thinking as I wrap everyone's gifts, depending on what we're doing this year for the holidays with everything going on. I thought I could put everyone's gifts in here, and when I go to their house, or if I need to mail it or something, then I can save this for next year. And last but not least, so going back to that theory of I have too much of certain items in my possession, I found these cute little tins. One is the checker print with the red truck on it that says, Tis the Season. And then this one has uh, the candy cane design on it. Since I have a lot of certain things, I'm going to fill these up with certain things for two special little girls that are absolutely amazing. The one's not so little anymore, but she's very appreciative for everything that I give her, regardless of what I spend. It's just the thought of her that, like, I know she is sincere when it comes to me giving her things. So I got her this one, and then I got her sister this tin. So that way they both get similar items, but they know whose is whose. And then all I have to do is pick up a few more odds and ends or see what I have at home to see if it fits all in there. But that's everything that I got today. Um... This was fun, I yeah. think. The wraps are done. She's called it. Raviolis are done. Okay. So this was our nice little haul. As I said, the holidays are growing closer. None of us know what to expect this holiday season. I expect a lot of annoyance. I don't know if we're going to be able to spend time with our loved ones and family or if we're going to have to go the other route and either do Facebook calling, Zoom calling, or just email or even uh, mail gifts this year. Who knows? Um, time will tell. This has your receipt in it. Okay. Time will tell. Uh, what to expect. Um, I guess this was our fun haul. Are you having fun yet? 
possibly. Okay, well, uh, we'll catch you guys later, maybe in a few minutes. I don't know. Peace out. Bye-bye.